Welcome everybody. In today's video, I'm going to take a couple minutes and tell you the difference between propane, LP, and natural gas when it comes to your water heater. And we're getting right to it. Welcome everybody to Plumbing with Tim. If this is your first time here and you're looking to sharpen your plumbing skills or just learn stuff, you came to the right place, take a moment and drop down the subscribe button. That way you're not going to miss any of my awesome videos. So one thing about being a plumber is you're going to have to know the difference when it comes to working on gas water heaters and electric water heaters. And when it comes to gas, it's something you don't want to play around with. It's almost like electricity. And you need to know whether you're working with propane or natural gas. So the first thing you're going to want to ask the customer is, do you have natural gas or are you on propane? They say, well, I'm not sure. First thing you want to ask them is, do you get a monthly bill from the gas company? If they say yes, then chances are pretty good you're going to be on natural gas. And if the customer is on natural gas at their home, chances are pretty good you're going to find a meter from the gas company somewhere located on the outside of the home. Now let's say it's a rental and they have no idea whatsoever. Well, you can take a minute and do a visual inspection of the home. You might be able to find a propane tank outside, so that's gonna really tell you the difference. Or if you have to, ask the tenant for the number for the landlord. Call him on the phone, ask him what is servicing the home. Okay, so what's the difference between LP, liquid propane, and natural gas? Well, I'm going to tell you. Natural gas is a combination of methane and ethane, which is settled on the top of crude oil and is lighter than air. LP gas, or liquid propane, is a combination of butane and propane. Now, natural gas and liquid propane are considered in the same characteristic as gases. The difference between them is the molecular size of particles inside that gas. Natural gas is lighter than air and burns hotter, and it has a lower pressure. Liquid propane creates a lot more carbons and is heavier and goes through your system at a higher pressure, especially when it comes to your gas water heaters and stuff, uh, your orifices, which the gas enters, is smaller when it comes to liquid propane, unlike uh, natural gas, which has a bigger orifice, okay? So why should I care? I put it this way, you don't want to put a hot water heater inside of a home that's on natural gas and you're hooking up propane heater. It doesn't work that way because you're going to end up having a failure and thank goodness that the industry has set a standard when it comes to gas water heaters to install during manufacturing protection devices that cut the thing off to protect your home and your heater from blowing up. These gases are clean burning, much cleaner than wood burning and stuff like that, yet not quite as clean burning as electric when it comes to water heaters and stuff. So make sure that you take the time and the moments to do your research of what exactly it is you have in your home before you make a mistake and install the wrong product. I'm going to get into super detail about any of this stuff. I just wanted to let you know the difference between these two types of gases. So this way you're going to know better than install something that's not properly equipped in your home. And I'm going to leave this video by showing you a small footage of a water heater that was installed in a home on a propane system, but the heater was natural gas. Bad things happen when that happens. And this heater was only installed about nine days ago. Okay, so if you take a look here, this is a, uh, a water heater, a natural gas water heater that was installed about nine days ago. And I got the call to go out and look at this thing. Well, somebody installed this on a liquid propane system. And if you take a look, look at all the carbon and everything uh, that happened in just that short period of time. Now, um, this is a rain water heater, 40 gallon, and as you can see, uh, I'm pointing into where the combustion chamber is. Back inside of there is a liquid filled glass fuse uh, that is installed by the company to, uh, as a protection device uh, to blow out first and to shut the heater down so you don't have an explosion. And good thing that happened, and here's the reason why. You don't want to put a natural gas water heater on a liquid propane system because it's going to fail on you and luckily these guys got lucky and it did its job. And so there you have it. I hope this video has helped you out in one way or another. Hey, I got them all day long. If you got any questions or concerns or maybe some comments, leave them down below and make sure not to forget to subscribe to my channel. Uh, safety is always of the essence when it comes to anything when it's plumbing involved, especially with gas. Gas you have to treat with respect just like electricity. So until next time, this has been Plumber with Tim. Keep on.